Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, so we are here wherever we are in the last video trying to go to wherever we're trying to go in this video, so let's try to finish off this quest. I have a weird feeling I'm going to run into a Spriggan that I'm not going to be able to kill very easily, which is also why I'm going to need to start seriously thinking about enchanting some items. Because if I can't even kill a Spriggan, then there's just going to be something wrong. Now, I do kind of want to give you some advice. Number one, if you equip your pickaxe, it's generally faster than mining it this way. And you can also dual wield pickaxes, which is pretty funny when you're walking around with two pickaxes. But this is a little bit lazier just because I don't have to switch weapons. And am I on transmute? Yes, I am. Also, be sure to transmute however many ores that you have. That gets your alteration up, and also, oh, I've got to change this again. Don't know why they haven't made that default by 90. Anyway, so, there's a, looks like there's a house up here. Let's grab this house, I guess. I mean, who knows, I may have to come here later. Oh, Kynes Grove! Yeah, I'm going to be coming here for a quest. Uh, don't tell me that that dragon attacks now. Chicken. Okay. Good. This will be very useful to have because now I won't have to walk here. <laughs> Too bad the only interesting thing that ever happens at Kynes Grove would be that dragon showing up. Okay. And there's also, I think this is in the middle of that swamp, right? Yeah, so right on the top of that thing there's a dragon. Hopefully I don't have to deal with him. Okay, this uh, creep cluster, that's what it's called. So if you mix creep cluster and a giant's toe together, you make health potions, I think. And supposedly that's one of the faster and easier ways to get your, uh, uh, whatever it's called up. Alchemy, that's the one. <laughs> Keep forgetting what it's called. Of course, none of it is nearly as difficult to raise as I thought it was in Morrowind. I had a really hard time getting my Morrowind alchemy up. Okay, well... Right, uh, at least this grove isn't inside anywhere, but it does appear that there's a hag raven. And that is definitely going to be a problem, because these hag ravens, I am sure, are just... Okay, the dragon's not going to help either. I am just absolutely sure that these things are ridiculously, stupidly strong right now, because they're still pretty dang strong even outside of the uh outside of legendary difficulty so this hag raven looks particularly okay what detected me i was gonna say what detected me all right now lydia i'm gonna ask you to stay here as you wish my thing hopefully okay what is detecting me you it better be you so let's see if I can sneak up on this here hag raven. I have an odd feeling I definitely will not be able to, but let's try it. Okay. So I made it behind her. Now let's see if I can actually get behind her. Of course, if I could fit through places that I could definitely fit through normally, that'd be better. Alright. Oh dear. Let's see if I can kind of shimmy across this part. Why are you moving over here? Okay, you're not. Oh! If that's not bullcrap, I don't know what isn't. But she didn't attack me. Does she want me to talk to her? Let's find out. Darling, I've been waiting for you to return to consummate our love. What? You want it for that hussy Esmeralda with the dark feathers? Don't you? I won't let her have you. Well, I have been a little bit surprised. I didn't think that I would like a hag raven? What? Yeah, I, okay then. That's on the interesting side. 
At least it seems she's really easy. Do I have healing? Yeah. And she's not using magic, so that's a benefit. Uh, wow. <laughs> well, I, everyone was okay with me wanting to marry Hagraven because I thought that they said like I met, I, they they met her, right? I don't I don't even remember. Huh. Okay then. Can she even hurt me? Oh yep, that does decent damage. It's just like really wide, I guess. I don't know, whatever it is, I sure married a weakling. Oh, don't heal yourself. Okay, I married a very persistent weakling. Well, at least I'm getting my one handed up. Oh, good level up. Not sure what I'm gonna put that in. I think I said defense. Because I need to work on damage reduction. There we go. Well, there's the wedding ring. And Hag Raven Feathers I might want later. What the heck? Meridia's Beacon. Isn't that a... Okay, where is this woman? There you are. You, have your dang wedding ring back. Once I've made enough money trading with the... Excellent. Sorry it didn't work out. I know how excited you were for the wedding. You kept saying it would be a huge ceremony at Morvenskar. You said you even had some magic staff that would handle all of the guests. Well, I guess now I'm heading on to Morvenskar. Before my ma and da passed, I told them that one day... I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You'd do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Farewell. Thought I had a mammoth tusk. You drive a hard bargain. It's always one of the best lines in Oblivion. Okay, that's my custom destination. Oh my goodness. So, everything's just way over here. Why isn't this quest in Windhelm then? Because everything's right next to Windhelm. I don't know what it is, but this game is just running spectacularly now. This was lagging like crazy a few videos ago. Okay, let's head on over there. Lydia, you are coming, right? I am also really terrible at making Lydia carry all of my stuff. I know that her uh, being a pack mule is just amazing, especially when you don't have bandoliers, but I, for some reason, I either forget to give my companions the items, or I give them the items. Good, holy crap, what was that? Okay, good. Jesus scared me. Or I give them the items, and then I forget to take them back. Wolves were not having a good day. That dragon's gonna be making sure- What the heck is that? A shrine at Talos? What is that doing there? Dragon, go away. I c maybe I could kill a regular dragon now. I'm not sure though. I really want resist potions or resist something. I might have to go find an alchemy shop and see what they sell. Anyway, let's head on up to this place. I wonder if I can actually kill that uh, thing now. Whatever it was. That- that- Ice Wraith that I couldn't kill before. Okay, I don't think I can go up in there. Oh, this is where having road maps are a lot better, Bethesda. Because I have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there. Pretty sure I have to go all the way around. And in Oblivion, if you were ever stuck, give me that creep cluster. Kind of interesting, I want that stuff when I have, like, no giant's toes. There we go. Anyway, in Oblivion, you could pretty easily just jump up a mountain just by tapping the jump button. It was kind of funny. Alright, let's see what's going to go on here. I don't see anybody yet. Okay.
Oh, there's somebody. Oh, crap. Dang it, Lydia, you stupid freaking idiot. I mean, if it's gonna light them on fire, I'll, I'll accept it. I'm not gonna deny that. Hidden. Okay. Maybe she doesn't detect me? Nah, she does. Gosh dang it. Whatever. This is not gonna go well for me. Oh my goodness, run away! Oh, no. What am I stuck on? Holy crap! I don't know how I'm not dead. It's kind of a miracle, really. Okay, wolf, go away. Lydia, if you don't die in that, I'm gonna be like stunned. I don't know when I last quick saved because I think I was terrified of that dragon. Lydia somehow is not dead. This woman should be. Shit. All right, conjurer, your turn. You die. Thank you. All right. So I'm going to grab this stuff, even though I'm pretty sure that uh, I can only disenchant it once, but I mostly want it just to be able to enchant later. I really am getting a little bit disappointed, though, because I thought for sure by now I'd be able to sneak up on people more. So I don't know if it's Lydia that's just uh, making them... Um, Maybe I should get rid of her and try it, try it out without her for a little while, because I really don't know if Lydia is the one that's just making everything detect me. But I feel like I'm... Or, or if Skyrim's just like this, I don't know. I've never tried to do a purely dagger stabby stab playthrough, because all my other stealth playthroughs were with bows and arrows, and it's really easy to hide with that. So, it, I don't know. I am just I thought for sure I could get it, you know to that point now where it'd be at least interesting but I know that it, it does work a little bit because it gets to a point where your sneak is so high you can sneak right in front of Draugr when they come out of their when they come out of their coffins and you can, uh, they won't see you so I know eventually it gets there I just thought for sure it would have gotten there by now so I don't know now I feel like there's gonna be a master conjurer in here and he's gonna be a complete pain in the rear since I can barely kill anything really Now this is where I had that shout that let me know. You know what? Maybe let's just get rid of healing. Like, I don't know. Maybe maybe that was doing it. There's a shout that you can shout that'll let you know where everybody is. So I'm pretty sure that guy's gonna see me, but let's just try it out. I bet Naris gets a kick out of this nasty fella. Over here. Yeah. Okay. Like, was that Lydia or was that me? I don't know. So I'm gonna reload that. I mean. My detection didn't go up until they stood up, so it's not like they saw me. I've got your back. As you wish, my thing. Or they saw Lydia and then they walked in. Or they did see me, I don't know. So that's that's what I'm gonna be testing here. I can't even cast muffle yet, so let's tr let's give it a try. Okay, no, they definitely saw me there. Well, they still haven't seen me, which is hilarious. Thirty times the damage, so that's like twenty-one times thirty.
Oh, come on. That would have worked in Assassin's Creed. Okay, you can't have that much mana. Like I said. Alright. Oh, I need healing. I didn't have healing. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Okay, so sneaking does actually work a little bit. That's good to know. Get that restoration up, and... I guess that'll be nice. Poison damage. I mean, why not? Wow, my wrist just cracked in like three places. <laughs> I'm gonna need that resist magic. I should have just hit take all. Yeah, we'll take all again. Okay. So sometimes these forges will have like bars of stuff. Yeah, iron. So I'll take all that. This might have. Yep, smithing. That is good for me. And. Alta wine. Whatever. Okay, let's head on down here, I guess, because there was nothing in there. Okay, so I am getting there with my sneak. I think maybe stepping into the light might have been part of it. I don't, like, I really don't know if that this game is that advanced with its technology or whatever you want to call it. See, here's a place, this is interesting. How the heck do you use a tanning rack inside? I mean, I'm pretty sure that fire, not to mention the fires indoors, Pretty sure that fire isn't enough to dry- I mean, maybe if you put it right over the fire, but it's all the way over here, so I'm pretty sure that wouldn't dry out and tan the- tan the leather, because fire doesn't produce UV radiation. So, that's- that's just kind of funny, but anyway. Lydia, come with me now. We heading out? As you command, my queen. I really should focus on getting you some decent armor. You know, the funny thing about- Oblivion was that you could get a really good beginner set of armor just by slaughtering a guard and then taking the skill penalty because your skills are pretty low to begin with. Uh, in this game, the guard's armor really isn't that good, so I guess they solved that issue. And you'd think they'd be a little bit more armored than they are just because it's freezing cold here, but when you're an Ord, don't gotta worry about that because you get like 50% resist to frost or something. Alrighty. What are we at? We are nearly at 20 minutes. Holy dang. I'll probably skip through most of this though. So, not that big of a deal. A yeah. About this. I am remembering this place. So there's definitely a mast or something up there. Now if there's some like absurd chance I could sneak up on him, that would be spectacular, but I don't think that's gonna happen. So I guess we'll quick save here and then keep trying and then I may have to come back here later again and I may be doing Throw to the World uh, first. I mean heck, if I could sneak through and just take the staff that'd be even better, but... Alright, now let's see, if I do this... No. I wish you could like throw a bottle... Oh, hello! Lydia, you're gonna get me killed. Okay. That was stupid.
And now I'm detected. I mean, I can't even sneak up on her when Lydia's distracting her. Alright, well, I guess we gotta YOLO it. Or Lydia's dead now. No, not yet. Where'd she go? Okay. So, now that I have this thing, there's this magic. As soon as she pelts me, though, I'm gonna be totally screwed, so I've really just gotta get Lydia to. Crap. And it doesn't even matter. Oh my gosh. Alright, well. Holy crap, this is ridiculous. This is considered really one of the easier quests. Okay, well, I think I'm going to give up for now because there's no way I'm going to be able to do this at all. There's just no way whatsoever. So I've obviously really got to start focusing on getting some uh, better armor. So I don't know if that means I'm really going to have to start grinding to get my stupid weapons up already because I I did not want to I do not want to go around to mines everywhere and clear them all out and do all that I do not want to do that yet but I think I got to get mines I got to get my smithing up I got to get my enchanting up oh. so there's not a whole lot else I can do uh did I miss anything I can pick up I mean this hopefully won't be a 30 minute video I don't even know how much of this I'm going to keep in but my gosh. It's just if the sneaking would work a little bit better, then I would be happier. But, as usual in games when it comes to sneaking, there's always just something stupid that happens. And heck, you know, this isn't even the problem with sneaking, this is just that stupid ice wizard that one-shots me. And again, I mean, it's not like I'm weak, I have apparel. 144 armor rating, which isn't high, but 200 health, I don't know.